One of the major modifications done to the easy car lift was adding a friction brake to prevent damage to the Ackman shaft when the drill is not stopped on a timely fashion by lowering. Unfortunately, the friction brake is activated when using the moving casters. This video will show how to add the anti-friction kit to the slave side of the easy car lift. Once all screws are removed, flip one of the sides upside down. You can place it on the top of the lift, on the sawhorses, on the workbench, on the table, or whatever. And pull the leg assembly out, remove both leg guides, and place it on a flat surface to remove the screws. Once placed on a flat surface, removed all four screws and removed the housing. There are several lifts assembled with a U-shaped gasket. If yours is one of them, just add the kit without to remove the U-gasket. Once the slave housing is in place, insert the leg guides and slide the assembly into the ramp.
If the Acme shaft does not slide in the coupling, turn the flats back and forth until it does. Caution: Do not turn more than 30 degrees or 1 12th of a turn, or the leg will be out of synchronization. Once all secured, turn the lift section right side up and modify the second side. 